Hello and welcome to another coaching session from LeadershipMentor.com. In our time together today, I want to share with you a small part of our full coaching program on pitfalls new leaders face. And, you know, being a new leader can be extremely frustrating, especially after the first 30 to 60 days. And we just want you to know that there are a lot of alternatives out there to really help the job to be much easier and to really gain success in that position much quicker. What I wanted to share with you is what got you here in your current position. It's not going to keep you here. So what we mean by that is you were probably promoted most likely if you're a new leader because you were a great employee. So you did things like you're, you had great attendance. Um, you probably were a, an expert in the position that you were in. People probably rallied around you. So you had some uh, unofficial leadership probably in that role. Oftentimes that's, that, those are the types of people that we promote, uh, especially from within an organization. But the challenge is that we, oftentimes we, we continue to do the same things as we did when we were a team member, and that just isn't going to cut it. You need to learn new skills. You have new responsibilities and probably most importantly new expectations and so doing what you did prior to being promoted is not going to really meet the expectations that the organization and your manager have for you so when we look at what you're actually hired for I want you to think of a conductor someone who's kind of conducting an orchestra you take all these different people who are playing different instruments you bring them all together to perform a song and much like that, that's what I want you to look at what we do as leaders. You have a group of people and you have to bring those people together in many different ways. And if you've been a community member for a while, you know that we do team meetings. We do one on ones. Uh, we talk about effective coaching and, and the right type of feedback. But all these things will help you to really orchestrate your team into a, a really well-performing team. And, and it's important that you understand, again, when you look at how you got promoted, that most likely has nothing to do with what you are expected to do currently. So that's really it. I want to encourage you to sign up for our free coaching. Um, I'd also like to encourage you to definitely sign up for our uh, new leader 90-day program that we have available. And it goes into this and about 11 other coaching sessions in much more detail. So that is it for this week. I hope you have a phenomenal week, and I'll talk to you again soon.